the toughest trick about this trip was figuring out how to get my guitar case mounted on the motorcycle. Jeff Hoffey from Hoffey Carbon Fiber Cases was generous and sponsored me and gave me this guitar case so I could take it on my trip. The trick was figuring out how to mount it on the motorcycle. So after doing a lot of research, I figured out how I could do it. So on the motorcycle side, I used a standard GV luggage mount that's made for this motorcycle. But the trick was the top latch here was interfering with the way the original bracket curved around the top, so I wasn't able to get it down on here. This is a universal mount, and most of the GV mounts don't have a bracket there. There's an empty space. Mine had a bracket, so I had to saw that bracket off and make this little Z-shaped thing so that I, the bracket could fit down on it. I also drilled a hole in the top here so that the uh, locking mechanism could just slip right down through it. And then you turn it, and, it, and it, the, the lock pulls down on the, on the mount so that it clips in there nice and tight. So you can see these three brackets. I bought these from a company called Caribou. And this is really made for putting on a Pelican case to mount it to your motorcycle. But I did a bunch of research and I found out it would work on this guitar case. So you can see there's two latches here and then there's a locking latch at the top. A Gibson J200. On the inside of the case, you can see I have a caribou plate here on the back and I just bolted it straight through the carbon fiber. The carbon fiber is very strong and very, very light, so it worked out really, really great. The only thing I changed is I used recessed hardware because it had button head hardware on it and I didn't want it to bump into my guitar any more than it needed to. So I took a countersink bit and used flathead hardware and, and drilled it down so it lay flat in there. And it only adds about an uh, eighth of an inch, if that, to the depth of the case, which is absorbed by the foam here. I just put this back in. And then this foam I just leave loose. And I can just pop it right back in there if I want to tighten the case or do anything else to it. I have to say, this case has been in the driving rain for over 30 miles and I didn't leak a drop of water into it. And that's a testament to the carbon fiber Hoffy case. So this is how I mount it. It's a little bit tricky, but once you get the hang of it, it's pretty easy. I purposely made it very, very close to the bike, so I keep the width of the motorcycle not too wide. And then twist it to the right. Locks right up. Good to go. Pop Over America is made possible by support from Hoffy Carbon Fiber Cases, Corbin Motorcycle Seats, and Diodario Strings. Please visit popoveramerica.com and don't forget to check us out on social media.